Come on, you motherfucker. Come on! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if New Bern, North Carolina is ready for this shit. All right. <laughs> so for those of you that don't know, Bill Hicks was the greatest comedian that ever lived. And he was more than a comedian, people. He was a philosopher. And he was a sociologist. He was fucking absolutely brilliant. And a few people are fans of anything that subverts of ingenious. <laughs> Lenny Bruce or Richard Pryor, probably Aqua Dean Hunger Force, quite frankly, or the fucking Simpsons or any of this shit that somehow gets on, you know, that's just fucking brilliant and is under the mainstream. And Bill Hicks is your fucking guy. And uh, he put out four records, Relentless Dangerous, Randy Minor, and Arizona Bay. Arizona Bay was after he moved back from L.A. He was hoping that L.A. would be flushed down the ocean like the turd that it is, and he'd be standing at his house in Arizona Bay wishing it was gone. That's funny, you fuckers, okay? <laughs> if you've ever been to L.A. and you realize what a plastic fucking piece of shit town that is, that was the joke that he was making. I go there when I want breast implants. Just a joke. Anyway, <laughs> seek him out if you don't know him. Thank you. And don't go to YouTube and read what poopy, the people that write the shit under YouTube, what, do they have lives? <laughs> do they have lives? No. They don't have lives. <laughs> I wish Bill Hicks was alive. I wish Bill Hicks had to lie. Hi. And I wish Bill Hicks was alive. I wish Bill Hicks had to lie. But as Bill will be the first to answer, this is the real world that he had cancer. I wish Bill Hicks was alive. my friends to see Bill do brilliant comedy me, me watch him be a little aristocrat I want to resurrect a moment for that I wish Bill Hicks was alive, alive for those of you that don't know Bill Hicks I would like to do for you right now one of my favorite Bill Hicks Routines. He was talking about religion and he said, you know, you gotta admit that religions are funny. He said, do you think that if Jesus comes back, he ever wants to see a fucking cross again in his life? <laughs> it's kind of like going up to Jackie Onassis with a rifle pendant and going, just thinking of John, Jackie. Just thinking of John. <laughs> That's what you're missing, people. He's also the first one to say he did that line in a small southern town and afterwards he had some people, kids come up to him and say, Hey, buddy, we don't like what you said. We're Christians. He said, then forgive me. <laughs> so the devil, he calls up to heaven and God says, put me through to God. God gets on the phone and says, what? The devil says, you got Bill Hicks up there? God says, yeah, two weeks, sold out. Gabriel Arena. The devil says sold out. God said, yup. We love them up there. We're busting them up for purgatory. The devil said, well, can I get tickets? God said, huh, what'd you ever do for me? The devil said, hey, without me, there'd be no you. The devil said, well, God said, well, I'll see what I can do. The devil said, you think give me some of them backstage passes? God said, you're pushing it. You're always, always pushing it. For all the reasons I just gave you. Crazy and you're on your own. And I hear Bill's voice after that.